Let's learn how to make a progress bar in Microsoft Excel. You'll learn how to make a simple progress bar based on a percentage like this. You'll learn how to apply the same technique to multiple values. And you will also learn how to make a progress bar even when you're not working with percentages. Okie dokie, let's begin. Say that you have a percentage in your spreadsheet somewhere and you want to create a progress bar to represent it. Start by selecting the cell where you want your progress bar to be, then enter equals, select the percentage cell, and press enter. After that, select the cell again, then go to conditional formatting, data bars, more rules. Start by checking the box next to show bar only. Now, if you want the percentage displayed over the bar in the same cell, then don't check this box. But most of the time, that's not the case, so keep this box checked. Next, change minimum to number, and also change maximum to number. Set the minimum to zero, and set the maximum to one. Then, where it says fill, you can select gradient fill or leave it as solid fill. It's up to you. After that, select a color that you want to use for the bar. And finally, click OK, and you have your progress bar. Okie dokie, let's move on to example two. How to apply this concept to multiple values at once. Starting with your first value, add a formula that references the percentage value like so. And once you have it working, you can copy that formula down to the other cells using the fill handle. From here, select all of the new percentages and go to Conditional Formatting, Data Bars, More Rules. Check the box next to Show Bar Only. Set the minimum and maximum to Number, and make sure the minimum is 0 and the maximum is 1. Select Gradient or Solid Fill, pick your favorite color, and finally click OK. Awesome! On to our last example. Let's say that you're not working with a percentage. Instead, you have a specific goal amount and then the actual amount. You want the progress bar to show how close you are to achieving the goal. Here's what you're going to do. Select the cell where you want the progress bar to be and write a formula that references the actual amount. After that, select the cell again and go to Conditional Formatting, Data Bars, More Rules. Check the box next to Show Bar Only. Set the minimum and maximum to Number, and then set the minimum to Zero or whatever the possible minimum might be for your specific scenario. And for the maximum, you can enter the goal amount manually, or you can reference the cell containing the goal amount. Both ways work. Once you've done that, Set up the fill how you want it, choose your color, and click OK. And that's all there is to it. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you again soon in the next Spreadsheet Life video. You're like a circle that floats around me, keeping me safe and sound. And when I fall, you tied a rope to me. Every day.